Kevin with MP Systems. Today we're going to talk about preventing new hire accidents. Started as a groundman, worked my way through the apprenticeship to be a lineman, foreman, and now general foreman. I've seen some good mentors, some bad mentors, and some self mentors where you train yourself. Here at MP Systems, we initiated a red hard hat program so that the entire job site can become a mentor around that red hard hat. First tip, get to know your new hire. Introduce yourself to them. Make time to sit down and talk about previous projects they've done, tasks that they've performed, equipment that they've utilized and operated. Make sure that they're comfortable asking questions when they need to. Ask questions to them, open-ended, so that they actually give you answers. Don't just leave a yes or no. Tip two, engage them in the plan. Thoroughly review the job brief with them. Make sure they understand their task for the day along with the overall scope of the day for the crew. After reviewing the job brief, ask them questions, something like, do you see any other hazards that we're gonna come across today? Are we missing anything in our plan? Down the road, have the new hire take the lead on the conversation of the job brief, identify the hazards that you're gonna be going through, and then fill in the gaps that they might've missed. Tip number three, trust but verify. What I mean by that is give them simple tasks to start, verify that they have the experience that they might have told you they did, it's easy for anybody to come in and say yes to a question, but then in the field, they don't have that actual experience. Pair them up with someone that has the experience, not only of the task, but of the company's expectations. Tip four, provide honest feedback. Coaching along the way helps. Don't wait till the end of the month or the end of the week to tell them all the things they did wrong. Give them attaboys, pats on the back as they're doing stuff right and then stop them when they're doing something wrong. Don't be kicking the can down the road and expect to have a conversation later. Head it up front, have those difficult conversations immediately so that that prevents any future incidents or accidents that might occur. Tip five, own the program. Don't let the new employee talk you into swapping out the hard hat early just because it's a different color. They need to prove themselves within the company and the mentors around them in order to earn the white hat. As a mentor, you set the culture. The red hats are gonna look at all the white hats, model safe behaviors. All the habits you show and you express, they'll mirror. Create an environment where questions are encouraged. At the end of the day, their safety is your responsibility. Teach them, train them, and mentor them the way you'd, you'd want your kid to be trained. Your stamp of approval means you're comfortable sending that new hire to another crew without close supervision. If you're not comfortable, don't send them.